Okay folks, today we're going to test this 1966 Chevelle and El Camino AM FM radio. Um, this radio will also fit 67 Chevelles and El Caminos, but is specific to the 66 model year for a few reasons. The model number is 986529, as you can see here, and uh, the 66 models came with flat push buttons here on the front so you can see these are totally flat on the front 67 models will be curved around the edges here uh, also this slide bar here uh, on 66 has these jagged edges on it in 67 they did away with that and made it more round uh, the reason being is in 1967 uh, due to Nader I believe they uh, changed the safety requirements to get rid of sharp edges like that so that made this radio even more rare than it is in that it's a first year model, uh, 66 Chevelle only. You can see it's got a curve to the front face plate here. Anyway, um, it's in nice shape overall. Uh, the chrome does shine well, but it does have some pitting. Um, as you probably know, there's a plastic chrome bezel that goes around this and around the entire radio. So as long as there's shine coming from there, that pretty much does the job. The original inner and outer knobs are included. Push buttons are really nice. The case is actually in real good shape. There's some light surface corrosion, but uh, I didn't see a reason to go crazy on it doesn't look to have been messed with before. The original transistor is here dated the 49th week of 65. The radio is also multiplex compatible so if you pull off this plug here you can plug a stereo multiplex adapter into it and it'll turn this radio from a single channel mono radio to a four channel stereo radio so it's kind of a cool upgrade. Anyway, uh, let's test it. Let me show you a couple things here first. Uh, first off, when you turn on the volume here, the uh, tone control moves along with it, as you can see there. So uh, it needs to be lubricated, or maybe even the volume control could be replaced. It's really up to you what your uh, final goal is. Um, also, what was I going to say? Oh, the, uh, the tuning shaft here on this side is just a little corroded, so it's a little bit smaller than it should be. Still holds the knob on there, still turns fine and everything, but uh, worth mentioning. And uh, finally, where I live here, uh, I live in a valley, and the AM signal doesn't come in about till the center of the dial. So just know that that's not the radio, uh, but that's just where I live. All right, let's test it out. So you can hear some vague channels coming in here, but. Until we get halfway through the dial, we're not going to get much. So you can see your ones here. Uh, I've there we go. To a handful of attorneys. Because the court ruled Monday, um, and, and in the words of Justice Alito, they. Say say three three seven six nine four nine. An iHeart Radio original podcast. Mm -hmm. Anyway, there's AM. Switch over to FM here. See the dial flips fully to FM. I'll go back to AM so you can see it flips fully back to AM. Start all the way from the end here. Look how the official. They fire him. Oh yeah, the wagon or the rover. I need somebody to hear somebody. Wood hasta llegar a Union Road. Espera tráfico lento tam. Herramienta? Herramienta. And travel through cracks in the walls and notice that as the old motor circuit you need what God is delivering through. Anyway, nice reception all the way through the dial here. Let me show you all the push buttons work. 
I have them set above each individual push button at the moment, and then I'll come back here. I need somebody Let's say we like this station. Somebody you pick any push button you like, pull it out, push it back in, then no matter where we go, we can go right back to where we were. Anyway, if you've been looking for a 66 only AM FM, you probably know that these very rarely come up for sale. This one does work well. Um, as I said, the volume control, you can see the toner moving with it there. So if that bothers you, that would need to be dealt with. Um, but servicing these radios does not cost very much. So if you decided to go that way, you know that you have a trouble free installation for years to come but it works well as it is. Anyway, don't miss it guys.